Hi everyone and welcome to this new video. Today we are going to make a delicious chocolate and caramel pie. You'll have all the details of the recipe and some advice in the video. You'll have all the ingredients in the description. Let's start by making the shortbread dough. You'll need 2 cups of flour, 1 4 cup of icing sugar, 2 third cup of butter, 1 pinch of salt, and one egg. Start by mixing the dry ingredients, flour, sugar, and salt. Add the egg. Start by mixing with a spoon to form a dough. Add the soft butter. Incorporate it with your hands in the bowl and on the working plan. The dough needs to be very soft. Put it in your fridge for 30 minutes and spread it finely to have a very crunchy dough. Place your dough in your mold and cut the surplus with a knife. One advice is to have a mold with a removable bottom. Pierce the dough with a fork and put it in the fridge for one hour. By doing this, the dough will not rise during the baking. Put it in the oven for 15 minutes, 190 degrees Celsius. The dough needs to be gilted and to come away the edge of the mold. Take your dough out of the oven, mix one egg yolk with 5 mm of milk, put it on the dough and on the edges. The dough will be very gilted and waterproof. Let's do the caramel. You'll need 1.5 cup of sugar, 3 quarters cup of cream, 1 quarter cup of butter. We'll do the caramel in 3 times. Put 1 third of the sugar in a saucepan and heat it up. When it is melted, put in the third of sugar. When all the sugar is melted, add the butter and the cream. Be careful, the caramel is boiling. To avoid this, put the cream in the saucepan and heat it up. Next, pour the caramel in your beautiful dough. Wait some minutes and put it in the fridge. Let's do the chocolate ganache. You'll need 180 grams of dark chocolate, 50 grams of milk chocolate, and one third cup of cream. Cut the chocolate very finely, eat the cream and when it is boiling, pour the half on the chocolate and mix it from the center to the edges. When it is well incorporated, pour the cream on it and mix it again. Wait some minutes and pour it on the dough that you have put 15 minutes in the freezer before. Pierce the air bubbles with a knife and put it in the fridge for one hour. The last step concerns the decoration. 
you'll need 50 grams of milk chocolate and pecan nuts. Melt the chocolate and spread it finely between two baking paper sheets. Place it in the freezer for 15 minutes. Put the pecan nuts and the chocolate on the pie. Well, it's done. The last step is to enjoy. If you have liked the video, don't forget to subscribe, to like, or to comment. Thank you and bon appétit.